Waconia Nuclear Station is located in the northwest corner of South Carolina. It went online in 1973 for Units 1 and 2. Unit 3 went online in 1974. So we've been producing electricity now for nearly 40 years. Over the past 10 years, the systems that we've upgraded uh, here at the site include uh, our turbine control systems, uh, many of our instrumentation systems, and of course our reactor protective system and engineered safeguard systems. The planning for the uh, reactor protection system project required a tremendous amount of engineering evaluations. It also entailed a, a lot of correspondence with the NRC to establish a, the licensing precedents for a first-of-a-kind digital replacement of an old analog protection system. Some of the key achievements for Oconee on the digital upgrades was the ability to be able to have a system that's now installed that has a good reliability. Although the previous system had reliability, it had issues from an obsolescence standpoint. We now have addressed all those issues and at the same time achieved some benefits of being able to provide online tracking and trending of information that was not available to begin with. Plus, we've got some additional redundancies such that if the system has problems, we will not have to react as quickly from a shutdown standpoint. In selecting the system, we started with uh, vendors that had an approved NRC safety evaluation report to go along with their hardware platform. And in that selection process, uh, Riva was uh, chosen as the uh, the vendor of choice for this project using the TXS safety system platform. The digital upgrades benefit the performance at Oconee uh, in a number of ways, but most importantly, safety. In addition to safety, the systems are much more reliable. So when you put reliability together with safety, you end up with systems that are easier to maintain, easier to operate, and again, that translates into better reliability and improved safety. One of the things that was instrumental in making sure that we had all this in place and went in smoothly was the involvement of all groups on site. We included a lot of personnel from various different departments, made sure that they were involved early enough so that we had their input in prior to the design, during the design, and as also as part of the installation activities. When I look back over the decision of leaders that I worked for 10 years ago who had the vision of what it would take to install a safety related digital system. I really stand very much in respect of what those leaders did. They knew it would be hard, they knew the cost would be great, they knew they had to find the right partner, they knew they had to get it through the licensing efforts, and all of this they knew would result in reliable and safe operation of the facility. And because of that vision, the trail is now blazed for the rest of the industry to be able to take advantage of the fruits of their labors.